All right, so the final Raiders Super Bowl win was played in 1984. It was between uh, the Los Angeles Raiders and the Washington Redskins. Um, yep, here's the patch for it. It was Super Bowl XVIII or Super Bowl 18. And the Raiders were once again led by Jim Plunkett and Tom Flores in route to victory. Um, they beat the Redskins very soundly, um, 38 to 9. It's funny, every you know Raiders Super Bowl, even if they're not the favorites in it they the ones that they won they won by a big margin 38 to 9 I mean that's a huge margin of victory and the Redskins were actually pretty much the favorites in this game because they were a very good team in this season um they you know were definitely a team that were respectable they were 14 and 2 in the regular season Raiders themselves were 12 and 4 uh, which was good as well and um you know it was a very exciting super bowl and it's interesting because raiders like i said were in la at this point so it was kind of you know a whole new thing and uh yeah so the raiders pretty much like i said dominated this game it was 38 to 9 they scored in every quarter um and uh took home their first super bowl as the los angeles raiders so let's get into the scoring uh so derek jensen got a uh special teams recovery fumble in the end zone and uh that put the Raiders up seven nothing right at the beginning of the game so Raiders are off to a great start that was the only scoring in the first quarter uh the Raiders Cliff Branch got a 12 yard touchdown pass from Jim Plunkett he was great in the previous Super Bowl and the Super Bowl before that so very much a Raider uh you know ride and die type of guy so 14 nothing Raiders the Redskins got on the board in the second quarter with a Mark Mosley 24 yard field goal which made it 14 to 3 and uh, the Raiders got a uh, five-yard interception return, pick six from Jack Squarek in the same quarter in the second, so it was 21-3. to I mean, the Raiders just dismantled them at this point. Uh, Redskins got a one-yard rushing touchdown, though, in the, uh, the, in, that same in the third quarter, actually, at that point. So it was 21-9, to um, followed then, though, by Marcus Allen, Raiders' amazing running back, got a five-yard rushing touchdown, which made it 28-9. Marcus Allen got a 74-yard rush, though, in the third quarter. Famous, you know, play, 74-yard rush. Made it 35-9. And then later, Raiders capped off the scoring with a 38-9 finish as 21-yard um, field goal from Chris Barr. So it was 38-9, uh, like I said. Yeah, so the Redskins were actually favored to win this, like I said. I mean, the Raiders this season were great. Um, it was probably one of their best seasons. Uh, but they, you know, had to face a good team, as usual. You know, Super Bowl is not easy. They faced uh, Joe Theismann, who obviously is famous as the Redskins quarterback in that era. He actually did pretty decent in this game besides his two interceptions. Uh, he was 16 of 35 for 243 yards, while Jim Plunkett was 16 of 25 for 172 yards. And he didn't throw an interception. His longest throw was 50 yards as well. Um, so that was pretty good to see from them. Um, but, uh, yeah, the Raiders, you know, did pretty good in this game. Marcus Allen, of course, won MVP for that amazing run performance. Uh, this game was in Tampa and, uh, the Red, yeah, like I said, Redskins were actually favored by three. So the Raiders, you know, surprised a lot of people in this game. Um, and, uh, yeah, it was, it was just an absolute beatdown. Um, and, um, the Redskins entered the game appearing to be better than the previous season. And they won the Super Bowl the previous year against the Dolphins. Um, and the Dolphins obviously, you know, suffered a lot of heartbreak when, you know, playing teams like this as well. And uh, the Redskins finished the regular season 14-2 and record, best in the NFL. And their two losses were only by one point each. So they could have been an undefeated team, the Redskins. They were a very good team. Uh, they set many records in this game. The Raiders were good too, but, you know, not, to, some might say, you know, regular season-wise, not to the degree that the Redskins were. Washington was just a very good team. It was the Raiders' fourth Super Bowl um, appearance. And uh, they had a 12 and four uh, season record. They were led by um, Todd Christensen. The tight end was very good receiving. He was actually like the, he, he led the NFL with 92 receptions for uh, t over 1200 yards and 12 touchdowns. Great player back then, back in the day. And um, obviously Jim Plunkett was throwing the ball to him a lot. Uh, Cliff Branch and uh, Malcolm Barnwell were great in this season as well. The Raiders only allowed a combined total of 24 points in their playoff victories. They beat the Steelers once again and the Seahawks. And, um, you know, Seahawks were AFC back then. And many know that the Raiders, you know, had, you know, kind of ties with them as rivals a little bit. And, uh, of course, the Steelers have always been rivals. But they soundly defeated the Steelers and the Seahawks. 38-10 to 10 over the Steelers and the Seahawks beat them 30-14. to 14. Marcus Allen was amazing in this playoff. So definitely deserving of MVP for Los Angeles. And the Raiders were awesome. I totally, 
you know, respect this era. Even though they weren't in Oakland, I actually really respect the Los Angeles Raiders time. And um, yeah, just an absolute beatdown. The Raiders, you know, their three Super Bowls showed how dominant of a team they are. And, um, you know, hope you know it's unfortunate they haven't been in the Super Bowl recently and haven't won it in a very long time. This is the most recent Raiders Super Bowl. They were the 1983 Raiders, and obviously the game is played in the next calendar year. So it was 1984 Super Bowl, Super Bowl 18, and you know it was just a very good win for the Raiders. And um, you know there was still a lot of heartbreak from them leaving Oakland, but I obviously the fans stuck with them a lot, and you know it was their. Uh, second season in Los Angeles I believe so they were very new in LA um, and uh, yeah it was it was very much a good season good victory for the Raiders beating the Washington Redskins by a final score of 38 to 9 like I said they were led by t head coach Tom Flores uh, the Redskins had Joe Gibbs at coach and um, yeah I mean overall just you know it's cool to see these old Raiders teams and I think you know they obviously have lost uh, some like some Super Bowls in their history, but the Raiders are known as a very winning franchise in terms of like playoff records and whatnot, and obviously not recently. So, yeah, this was the most recent Raiders Super Bowl, Los Angeles Raiders. <laughs> it just shows how old it is. But um, yeah. So, anyways, guys, that'll do it for Raiders Super Bowl wins. Only three of them, and um, we'll move on to the Warriors series next. And uh, so, yeah. Anyways, guys, let me know your thoughts. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later. And go Raiders.